Camera number 263 of 365 is this uh, Yashica 270 autofocus. Uh, certainly has a number of features on the camera, but uh, we have to insert a battery to make them all work. So placing a battery uh, is in the base of the camera here, and then we have to unlock it. I'm going to have to, I think, need oops, a coin for that. So there we go. And then it takes uh, a 2CR5 battery, which goes in there, and then close the door and lock it if we can. There we go. And then uh, on the front here, we have uh, the Ashika Contax uh, um, lens mount. And we take our lens off by depressing the lens release. And the lens I used to take these photographs was the uh, AF 28-70 3.5-stroke 4.5 lens. And then uh, on the front, not a lot really, um, the self-timer light and perhaps autofocus assist. And then our little button that allows us to uh, Blocker switch rather allows us to choose autofocus or manual focus. A, I believe that's a the aperture button when we go into manual mode. I think it does have a, another function, um, but I can't off the top of my head remember what that is. So maybe someone can correct me there. Uh, that's pretty much it there so let's just put the lens back on and then on the top we have our on off switch we have our liquid crystal display there's not a lot of information in the viewfinder which is kind of counterintuitive really this camera was uh, sort of um, held up as being a very easy to use and it is in the sense that you just literally focus and you get uh, a red confirmation or green confirmation if i remember rightly for focus um, you do get a red button in manual mode for uh, exposure, otherwise you have to look at the liquid crystal display, which means you have to take your eye off the uh, out of the viewfinder, so I'm not quite sure there. There we go. But anyway, uh, on-off switch, our uh, mode button, which if I can show you there, if we press that down, so we have program mode, aperture priority, shutter priority, and manual mode. And then the drive mode button, press that, we can go through multiple, uh, sorry, continuous exposure, self timer. I believe if I remember rightly, that's trap focusing, uh, which uh, is an interesting, and then uh, just single release. Okay. Now we do have a factory reset button, the P, takes us back to uh, program mode, if I remember rightly. Or not? Maybe it doesn't. No, it doesn't. Okay. Yes, it does. There we go. We have to press it in quite firmly. So that's like a factory reset. And then on the other side, we have our rocker button, which we have to use in association with some of these buttons, our shutter button. And then uh, F range. Um, to assist in the focusing, we can choose uh, distance or near subjects. Apparently, by pressing one or one of them that uh, is meant to quicken up the uh, focus. I don't know that it does actually, because it means you have to press the button, another button to press really. So not quite sure the uh, the thinking there. And then exposure compensation button there. Um, and then flash there. I believe, if I'm rightly, that is just um, memory lock, I think. Seems to be a memory lock button. But again, I could be wrong there. Okay. Um, provision for a cable release, although it has to be automatic or electronic rather, um, one. And then our film chamber, we have the X coding only, I believe. We can't change the ISO on this camera. As I mentioned, there is this button here, which when we put it into manual mode, we have to hold that for the aperture, otherwise the shutter speed is rocked there, I think. Let me just confirm that that is the case. Let's put it in manual mode. 
yeah, there you go. So shutter speed, and then press this button, and we can change our aperture. Hopefully, he says. Yes, there we go. It's changing. Excellent. Okay, so that's just a very quick uh, overview. Bit of a disappointment with the viewfinder that you can't see any information. Just green, a uh, couple of uh, LEDs. But there you go. So that is camera number two hundred and sixty-three of three hundred and sixty-five. And use our rocker switch, we can go into program mode. And then we've got an aperture priority, a shutter priority. No, the other way around, sorry. Shutter priority. No, that is, sorry, I'm getting confused. That's shutter priority. Manual mode, program mode. So let's just do that again.